Lil Tay's back because he's broke ass cop trying to take my phone away. Think I'm gonna be under house arrest. No one's gonna try to stop Lil Tay from flexing. No! Ah! And so, as we commit this young child to the earth, let us all be reminded. Stop! Stop! Right now, stop! Let me tell you something. Let me tell you. What? More than a million kids come up missing per year. What do y'all think happened to these kids? And every time people come up missing, the more and more people come up missing, the more they release more children. Man, oh man, boys. Man, oh man. I wanna, you know, before I show my face on camera, Gay girl. I'm gonna give you a few moments to guess the color do rag I'm wearing. That's enough time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, swagged out in purple today for my return. Looking like freezer and shit. You monkey! What? Say hi to Gengar. Now say goodbye. There must have been an angel by my side. <laughs> Alright, guys. So I'm back. You've probably been wondering where I've been. I had two false strikes on my channel. I was getting age restricted almost every post. Uh, basically, this Indian guy just didn't want me to post. Don't know why. Ordinary Gamer's dad, can I make this video please in peace? Without you touching my channel, please leave me alone. Lil Tay, I wasn't here for the news, but we're going to discuss it because I'm here now and I want to talk about it, okay? Forget all these moist criticals and these, these you know, these other comments. It, it's mini clean time. It's mini clean time. Play the in. Right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the Minikin channel. <laughs> it's been a while since you've seen my face, hasn't it? Follow my socials though, you know what I'm saying? All it does is take, all it takes is a little follow. That's that's all, you know what I'm just saying? Okay. Join the Reddit, we're coming up to 2k members. Listen, try not to laugh, will be Friday. I don't care, or Saturday. I'm gonna go live Friday or Saturday. Have your notifications on, be there, or be square like SpongeBob. <gasps> Lil Tay, now if you guys don't know who Lil Tay is, um, you're probably wondering, Minikin, of course we know who Lil Tay is. Shut your bitch <laughs> Trust me, you would be surprised because um, it's been years since Lil Tay was viral on the internet and I'm not gonna lie, a lot of viewers that watch me and a, a lot of viewers of the internet nowadays uh, are just growing up now. You wanna know why we're called Gen Z? Because Z is the last letter of the alphabet and we're the last generation to put up with all the- So they probably don't know who this is, but if you don't know who this is, she was another tacky viral moment in like 2016, 2017 with like Lil Pump Whoa, Vicky and Bad Baby, Catch Me Outside and all that shit. Those cringe losers. She was some little Asian girl that pretended that she had all the money and she was the youngest flex of the century. Bitch, I just bought a Lamborghini. Y'all bitches can't afford this shit, okay? I'm only nine years Y'all niggas is broke. Y'all niggas is bums. Y'all niggas ain't getting no bread. I'm getting all this bread to the bread. Turns out none of that money was hers. As for her schooling. I'm a Harvard dropout. What city is Harvard in? Um... Make <clears throat> and um, her brother made her say all of that. Go back, go back and say like, no, you, you, you broke, broke ass bitch. You still, you, you out here, you were out, out here like with your irrelevant ass. I knew it was fake. I knew it. I knew. And her mom was literally like a realtor or some shit. Like I don't even know the story. I don't really care to be honest. I never really dug deep into it. But yeah. Uh, apparently she died. I was gone for two weeks and she it, it was GG for her. Apparently she just got like she got sent to the fucking gulag. <laughs> apparently Lil Tay was gone, alright? Everyone was posting it. I saw it on Twitter while I was banned for two weeks. And I was like, Damn, I remember Lil Tay. That's sad as hell. Let me tweet RIP Lil Tay, that's crazy, man. Got him. We fucking got him. <laughs> but something fucking told me. That this little shit was not dead. Like something was telling me that it wasn't. Because if you don't know, this person, Lil Tay, and her whole entire family, okay, are known for scandals. And when I mean scandals, I, they're known for bullshit. So apparently, um, it is deeper than that. What? I went to see if this was actually real, right? So I went to her Instagram, and this is what this Instagram post said. It is with heavy heart that we have. You get it. Like basically, it was like a whole statement saying that she died. 
Turns out she got hacked and she's alive. So this whole thing is confusing as shit. And I wanted to make a video on this because I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Lil Tay didn't die. Like she just didn't die, obviously. But then apparently there was like reports that she's in an ab And then there was things about people that they found on her YouTube channel saying, help me. Like they call the cops. <laughs> Nobody knows what the fuck is going on with Lil Tay. Like at all. At all. And I'm here to say, where are the police? Like, I'm just being completely real. Where are the feds? This is probably going to be one of my bullshit ass videos. Terrible video to come back to. Only way we could basically describe this whole scenario is if we go on TikTok. Like, that's literally it. So later on, I'm going to go on TikTok and I'm going to search Lil Tay and see what comes up. Because this whole thing is just baffling me. Like, what the fuck is going on, first of all? And secondly, this is like the last time I believe anything about Lil Tay. I'm just being completely wrong. So I'm gonna go on TikTok because I have nothing else to say. And I feel like reacting to something will make me talk more. I'm hearing that she's getting used and shit, which is like, you know what I'm saying? Kind of fucked up. Where are the feds though? Like, what, what can we get? Like, not gonna lie. Why do her parents still have custody of her if they're making, uh, they're faking deaths and shit online? Like, what the fuck? She's getting out of hand. Alright, so this is my TikTok profile. Now, I could just sit here and read fucking boring ass articles from, like, journalists that no one gives a shit about. But, um, to do it today, I decided, why don't we treat fucking TikTok like it's the journalists because it's more interesting? I don't know. Shut up, bitch. You guys don't want to sit here and watch me read. So there, here is my TikTok page. Yeah, I don't fucking use this. I only use this to like shit, and that's pretty much it. I don't post. I haven't posted since... I don't even know when the last time I posted this bullshit. So as you guys can see, we're gonna just go through them so we can, uh, so I can fully, cause I haven't really paid attention to this shit. This is my fucking first time really getting into it. You know what I'm saying? Oh brother, this guy still- I'm making no sense today. I'm not gonna lie, I did just wake up. Lil Tay is reportedly alive. TMZ is reporting that Lil Tay and her brother are both alive and that her- Yo, Daily Mail, Daily Mail. <laughs> are we using AIs? To fucking narrate TikToks now? Is this what we're doing? Are you niggas this lazy, bro? Like, what? I, I, I just thought that was weird, bro. This shit doesn't sound like a human. Lil Tay is reportedly alive. TMZ okay. is reporting that Lil Tay and her brother are both alive and that her Instagram was hacked. She tells the outlet, I want- But I am telling you- Really? I want to make it clear that my brother and I are safe and alive, but I'm completely heartbroken and struggling to even find the right words to say. It's been a very traumatizing 24 hours all day- She wrote- She said this? Stop the cap. <laughs> it's either she got older, which she clearly did, and a little bit smart with words, or this is a complete PR, like just wrote this whole thing for her. Yesterday, I was bombarded with endless heartbreaking and tearful phone calls from loved ones, all while trying to sort out this mess. She also says her legal name is not Claire Hope, but Tatian, and that- Is this nigga serious? You see, this is, this is what I was talking about in the beginning. Do you see what I'm talking about in the beginning? This is, this is exactly what I was talking about. You can't believe anything from this entire little Tay fucking group. You know what I'm saying? That's not even her name. Her name has changed like three times. I'm not even jo She has her Instagram back after a third party hacked her and spread jarring misinformation. The okay. outlet did not know why it took her and her family 24 hours to announce that she is still alive. Stay with Daily Mail for more updates. Fuck off, Daily Mail. Lil Tay, the biggest flexor of the century, is back. I don't know who told these TikTokers, right? That you need to fucking shout like I'm far away or something to like catch people's attention. Please stop doing that. That's some YouTube short shit. Please. Back from the dead and you have a Twitch streamer to thank for it. On Wednesday, the what? internet world was shocked to see that 14-year-old influencer Lil Tay had passed away. Can we, uh, can we, can we, but first of all, she never died. Why are they saying this shit is back from the dead like this is Chief Keeps fucking mixed it or something? She never died. What do you, what do you mean? It was just cat. Way. She posted a statement on her Instagram page saying that she and her brother- They go another player to- you gotta kill your yeah, loyalty and love because oh. love really don't mean what? that. What? No, 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 no. <laughs> no, there's, there's no way. What? Okay, no, 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 this isn't real. This isn't real. Is this Lil Tay? No, fuck off. Fuck off, this is not Lil Tay. Lil Tay is alive, and the captions, yo, I'm okay. What did I just see? Really? 
There's no way that this isn't real, bro. Is this what you is this what you guys are doing? Pretending to be a 15 year old that is potentially in a, a serious situation <laughs> for likes? Really? Bitch, you got 270 <laughs> likes. This wasn't even worth it. Like, what? I gotta have loyalty and love because love really don't mean jack. See, love is just a feeling you can love somebody, still stab them in their back. Go get a job. Go get a job. I, Lil Tay, died at the age of 14. That is not Lil Tay. <laughs> Who are these niggas? <laughs> I'm sorry, this is so off topic, but I've seen so many fucking accounts like this where basically they get like an AI generated version of someone that's died or some shit and they're like, hi, my name is Michael Jackson and this is how I die. Please stop doing that. It is the corniest shit I've fucking ever seen. Like, look at this shit. Like, this is a prime example. This is not a little Tay. I, Lil Tay, died at the age of 14. I was Lil like, Tay, who is this? a 14 year old teen rapper known for my rapper? personality and flashy lifestyle. I ain't never heard of one Lil Tay song, I'm being honest. I haven't heard one Lil Tay song in my life. My life was like a whirlwind filled with fame and attention. But one day everything what the changed fuck is in the most shit? unexpected and tragic way. My days were all about music, flashy cars, and showing off expensive things. People on the internet who has made this? every move and I enjoyed being the center of attention. But behind the scenes, Life wasn't always as glamorous as it seemed. Then came the day that turned everything upside down. What the fuck something is this? Something mysterious happened. Oh, something and I mysterious? I found myself facing a fate I never saw coming. Oh, really? At just 14 years old, my life was cut short in a way She's that not 14, she's, she's 15. You couldn't even get the age right, buddy. No one could explain. The news of my passing shocked everyone who knew Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It was fake. It was fucking fake. Fuck out of here. What is this stupid account? Yo, stop making videos like this. This shit is gay as fuck. If you think Lil Tay is dead, you might want to hear this. Lil Tay's father declines to tell- 40 years old. <laughs> like, I'm not even trying to be a dick or anything. 40 years old, shouting at me on TikTok, bro. And look how many like- Why the fuck does this have almost 100,000 likes? Why? Niggas, I missed the beat! If you think Lil Tay is dead, you might want to hear this. Lil Tay's father declines to tell Insider whether or not she's actually deceased. Additionally, her former manager told the newspaper that he is unable to definitively confirm or dismiss the death. Plus, the Vancouver and Los Angeles police departments have denied- Alright, so basically what you're trying to tell me is the dad is dodgy, lock him up. Like, why is this such a big thing? The dad is sketchy, lock him up, investigate. That's what I've got from this whole situation. Because anytime something happens to Lil Tay, like... The nigga, the, the Lil- her, her fucking dad get mentions more than any- They're investigating the death of Lil Tay, claims they have no record of her death, and have not been alerted of her death. Also, somebody put a prop through ChatGPT. Okay, can we just say this? And I'm probably vi I am victim of this, right? Why did everybody just automatically believe this without getting any confirmation? Like, like at all? Like actual confirmation from like the news or like the police? I know, stupid. The family released earlier about their daughter's tragic unaliving. Unk, what are you talking I mean, about? I'm does any of this make any sense? Lil Tay's 14. She used to do wild and crazy stuff to get. Uh, clout when she was eight and now her dad's trying to get her money allegedly and both her and her brother were unalived at a car crash Nigga sit the hell up and eat a cinnamon roll. I be in codeine, don't get no fuss about my look Hey they cook Hook me up My style like style, yeah, I be in I need drugs My style like style, yeah, she don't get no fuss I free, yeah, be You know what to do Flood the comments, okay? Let me know what you guys think about this, all right? Do you think Lil Tay's behind this? Do you think Lil Tay... I, I don't know. But tell me what you think about this. Comment, flood the comments, share the video, all right? Among us! Listen, I know this was probably one of my most boring videos I've made for a long time. I'm sorry, um, but like, it is what it is. I'm back. Hopefully, YouTube will leave me alone and let me post this fucking video. Try to get fucking, I don't know, 4K likes in a day. I don't know where the state of the channel is at now. It might be completely fucking dead. So, hey, I, I gotta lower the likes again. But yeah, boys, I'll see you guys next time in the next internet video. Go fuck yourself. I cannot fuck with these niggas. I cannot fuck with these bitches. I'm trying to get my rest, nigga. They see me like, hey, nigga.